Hello, welcome to Vet Century 7. In this short video, I'd like to go over a couple aspects of using Vet Century 7 within your Internet Explorer browser and using Adobe Acrobat Reader. Now, the first thing we want to discuss is making sure your Adobe Acrobat Reader is set up for using the Adobe documents within your uh, IE browser, your Internet Explorer browser. Uh, by default, it sets up to use that way, but uh, sometimes you do need to change that setting. You just open up your Adobe. I'm in Adobe 11. You go to Edit, Preferences. And then there you go to the Internet over here as a category. And you just want to make sure these are all checked. And this will display an Adobe document within your Internet Explorer browser. Uh, the other thing you may need to do from time to time uh, is just check to make your settings within your Internet Explorer browser, uh, and that's in the uh, Manage Add-ons area here over in the tools up in this gear. And you can see in here then it has the Adobe PDF Reader is enabled, um, and that is the preferred reader uh, that uh, Internet Explorer uses. Now if you're using uh, Firefox here, uh, theirs is a little different. Theirs actually sets up to use their own PDF browser uh, within um, the uh, Firefox um, product. So what you need to do is, is go to your tools menu here and go to options. And it's quite simple. In the tools option you go to applications. You can see it says Adobe, Adobe, and Adobe here. And they all are used within Firefox. And then over here, the portable document file, it says preview in Firefox. What you want to do is say uh, use Adobe in Firefox. That's the choice you want to make so that they all match. That way when you open up our program in a, in a CVI, it'll open up exactly as it should within the Adobe program. Again, in Chrome, you need to make the same setting. Now here I am in Chrome. You would just go to Chrome colon forward slash forward slash plugins and again uh, they have their own built-in uh, Chrome PDF viewer here you can see it says Chrome PDF viewer I disabled that and I enabled the Adobe Reader within Chrome and you only have to do that once once you do it it's set and you click always allow and now uh, PDF documents will again open up within your Chrome browser so those are the three settings you want to make sure, depending on if you're using Internet Explorer, if you're using Google Chrome, then you've got to change the plugins to, to make sure the Adobe works. And then again, if you're using uh, Mozilla Firefox, you've got to go to Tools and Options and, and make sure everything's set up to use Adobe Acrobat within your browser. And if you have any questions on how to do this, please contact me, and uh, we'll be happy to walk you through making sure you're set up properly. Thank you.